Yes guys, how's it going? Welcome back to a new video. It's match day. It feels like ages since Newcastle have been playing at St James's Park and they are today, 12.30 kickoff, bank holiday Saturday. I'm hoping it's going to be a good one if we get the win. We want European football for next season. Eddie Howe spoken about it yesterday in his interview. The season is not over yet and despite Botman injuries, um, Tonali, Bands, we have to make a push for it. Taking on a tough West Ham team. I'm hoping we can do it. Then go get some breakfast, get some beers, early start, kick off, hopefully a win. Let's get going. Wow, look at that. Starting the day strong. Here we go. Buddy, thank you very much. Before I let you go, what's your match score? Buddy, doing this pretty much chat. Two one from him. I hope he's right. Sounds beautiful to me, Mr. Ren. Thank you very much for your time, sir. Enjoy the game. Buddy, Ren, give up. Here he is, the main man, Mr. Hello. Matty from the Magpie Channel. How are you, pal? Oh, I'm great, mate. Nice. Bank fantastic. holiday weekend. I know my pain's insane. I don't know. <laughs> early start. Yeah, um, early start. Down at Pumphreys. Oh. You don't know it. Matty does the pre match chats here, yes, so mate. I'll be starting in five minutes. Looking forward to that. I'll right, about five minutes late, I think. And what are you going to say that we're going to win? I'm going to say we're going to win, Rob. Listen, I'm going to say we'll have to win. Yeah, That's what I practice well. today. It is. This, this gets thrown about quite a bit, and there's 10 games to go, but it is a six point after me, mate. If we, we are literally looking at West Ham United above us to, in a sense, beat them, to get yes. above them, to do what they did last year, get in the Europe win a trophy. That's why I'm looking at. Well, the, the thing is, yesterday I was talking about we're going to win. I was like, 2-1, we're going to do it. And then now I'm standing here looking at the league table there. Four points ahead of us at the moment. So if we win, we're only one point behind them and they're in seventh place. If they win, that's seven-point gap. I mean, we've, uh... we've got ten games to go and there's plenty of time. But yeah. I tell you what, a win today would... Be a good start. It's funny because if you say we're going to win, then I'm, I'm fully back and you know us to get seventh or eighth and get European football. But then when you've just said they're, their lead increasing, it just shows the magnitude of the today's game for me. It shows that honestly, this this next week is going to dictate the season. Ever, 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 yeah, yeah. Fulham away, which if you win the next two at home, you get a draw against Fulham, it's not bad. But uh, today we've got to start with a win, man. We've got to close that gap to one point and then we'd have a game in hand. I know. It's on us. So say early kick off on the beers. It'll be a much nicer day if we can get something oh, from it. Will. Prediction, Matty? I'm going to go for a 2-1 win, mate. I think it will be an open game. Lots of people are saying 2-1. Yeah, which which makes us want to change me because when the, the general <laughs> consensus is that, I'm, I'm regretting the bet. But I'm going to stick with the 2-1. I'm going to say, you know, he's actually going to be the difference. Anthony Gowen's on a high after playing for England. Yeah. I'm backing him, mate. I'm backing him. Backing it, 2-1. I, I actually said oh, the same yesterday in mine, so yeah. I'll back it as well. Nice. I think... I think even a draw is okay because it stops yeah, them getting yeah, further away. Yeah, that, the that's the thing, because if, if we lose there, it's like six points, isn't it, basically? Yeah, yeah. If we win, we're behind them. If they win, they might, if a draw keeps us all in it. But, yeah, I'd rather win. Absolutely, mate. It's only saying the beers are thrown. It's breakfast. Let's go. And we've got to get in for your, <laughs> for your chat, right? Yeah, Cheers, Matty. Cheers, Catch you in a bit. Thanks, man. Come on, lads. Cheers. There it is, back for what feels like the first time in ages. The sun is shining. Let's make it count. Here you go, a little bit of uh, behind the scenes on the stack. Can't, <laughs> you can only see the back side of it, like, but that's where it's going to be. Loads of containers. Imagine with the sun out as well. Here we go. Tell you what, some things never change. I was in town half 10 this morning and I'm still late. <laughs> well, right on time, right on time. Um, lineups are out. No trip yet. No trip yet at all in the squad. Not sure what's going on there. So it's Livermento, right back Dan, Burn, left back Lascelles and Shaw. They've West Ham attacking the line looks good today. You know what I mean? I said earlier on, I'm going for the win, but it's going to be tough. Isaac and Gordon up front. Bruno in the middle with Willick and Longstaff. You know, on our day, we can, we can do well. 
an early goal. I think we, we you know, strive when we are, we are confident. Um, an early goal would do that. So, yeah. I'll, I'll tell you what, I'll save you the trouble of mourning about the queues. I'll just show you a bit of them and then we'll get inside. I couldn't help myself. Look at this man. Sorry, lads. It just gets worse every week. It's just insane. Dear God. The queues, the digital ticking takes ages, man. Here we go, I told you I'm never late. Perfectly timed. Oh, Pack Stadium. Bank holiday. Let's get the job done. Some work to do now. Or not? Let's have score before most people have even got back to their seats. Total <laughs> lack of thought. Error. Born through on goal on his own. It was our corner. And they've scored. Come on, Isaac. Yeah!